Taylor Smith from Bridge Crew here, and I'm going to talk about our custom policy APIs that we just added, as well as our first use case for them, uh, adding Bridge Crew custom policies to Chekhov. Now, our custom API policy, our custom policy APIs are CRUD APIs. So that means you can create, read, update, and delete custom policies from the API using a code interface. Um, and what we've basically done is we've taken the read capability of that CRUD API, and so we can read in the custom policies from Bridge Crew and add them into Chekhov scans. So I'm going to talk. About, I'm going to show what that looks like. Jumping over into our reference docs, you can take a look at all the different APIs that we have here, cross errors, policy suppressions, etc. So if I go into the policies one, this one's the new one, and I do the git, you can see that I can do a curl command, and I can reach out to this API endpoint and get back the data on the, on the custom policies. So you can see the account data, the benchmark that that policy came from, the category, et cetera. And all of that comes back in a JSON. You can see you can do that through curl, node, Ruby, PHP, or Python. So what does it look like when you're adding those to Chekhov? Well, first you're going to need your API key. So go to your integrations tab in the Bridge Crew platform and go down to the API token and copy that. Now I am able to tap into the Bridge Crew platform to get my custom policies from Chekhov. So if I go to the policy section, and I'm just going to filter by policies created by my organization, the Tri Bridge Crew org, and I've added this undersized instances policy. You can see what it's doing basically is it's checking for AWS instances that are T2 micros or T2 nanos. And all of this is uses our code policy editor, so it'll help you autocomplete. And that makes it really easy to write policies. It's a lot easier to write the YAML here than in a code editor. It also lets you test the policy before you add it to your um, custom policy library. And what this will do is it will go out and find against, compare this policy against all the repos and runtime environments that you already have onboarded in Bridge Crew. So you can see here are all the violations I have against this policy. So each of these have a T2, here we go, this one T2 nano. So each of these have a T2 man, nano or micro deployment. So that's my custom policy. Now I'm going to head over to my CLI and what I can do is I can just simply add my API key just like I would before if I wanted to get the results into my into the bridge group platform and the repo ID to check off when I scan the A Terraform AWS EC2 Terraform file from Terago. Now this is going to include all the policies that out of the box policies that Chekhov already has for the EC2 file type. And it's also going to include that custom policy. And the nice thing too, is this will bring it back to the bridge crew platform, all those results, including the custom policy. All right. So now that we've done this scan, let's just go back through and you can see all the different violations. Let's see if we can find that custom policy. You can see here's one of the custom policies and they're going to have a name like that where it's the creator the uh, in the cloud and then a random number assigned to it. Um, so once it's done that, it'll, let's see, we'll go back through and here we go. Here's that custom policy that I made. 
the undersized instances. So it pulls up the resource block where that violation happened. And it even calls out um, the name of that custom policy. Now, the nice thing is I can also, by clicking on this link, bring it back to the bridge crew platform. And this will show in the code reviews, but also the project screen, that custom policy violation, even though I scanned it from checkoff. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back. While this is loading, and I'm just gonna go back to one run that I ran right before this. And you can see all the way, if I scroll all the way to the bottom, that undersized instances custom policy also shows up in my code reviews. Now, the last thing I want to show off is in VS Code with our extension, those custom policies will now also populate for VS Code. So here's that Terragoat EC2 file. And if I check out the first resource block, all the way at the bottom, there's that undersized instances. So in my code block, I now have directly the misconfigurations that I've created, the custom policies that I've created. And that's for that T2 micro instance that I found. And that's our custom policy API in action. You can find out more on the blog and you can try it for yourself by making your own custom policy in Bridge Crew and attaching your API key to Chekhov. We're also looking for new integrations that you can do with the custom policy API. So come up with your own and let us know what you would like to see built. Thanks.